Okay. Hello, my name is Brian Harris, principal at Hay Elementary School. Hay Elementary School was founded by Forrest G. Hay, who was a veteran of World War I and a businessman from North Liberty. Upon his return from the war, Mr. Hay went into partnership with another uh, friend of his as an undertaker. He later opened up Forrest G. Hay Funeral Home, which is now known as McGann and Hay Funeral Home. In 1953, he donated seven acres of parcel on the south side of town where Hay Elementary School was built in 1954 and continues to serve our community today. Hay Elementary School is located at 19685 Johnson Road, just southwest of the fairgrounds. About our staff, our teachers are a group of caring, supportive, nurturing and welcoming people. We serve our students from the neighborhood as well as students throughout South Bend. Upon entering the building, you will immediately notice the sense of peace and community in the hallways. When you enter a classroom, you will find engaged students in a meaningful, rigorous curriculum while being in a safe and fun environment. As for our parents, we love to have our parents to come in and volunteer. Our parents are used for our fun fairs. They are used for reading with students, which is very, very key. They are used for our field day activities as well as school dances. All volunteers must have a background check prior to attending and entering the building. We also offer after school tutoring programs three days a week. How is the day at Hay measured? Well, we start our day off every morning at 740 by welcoming our students. Students have a choice of eating breakfast or just waiting for the school day to begin in the gymnasium. At the end of the day, students are released at 3.10 p.m. We have a designated area for students who are being dropped off in the morning and picked up in the afternoon. We also have a food drive every year which uh, benefits our community. That is one way that Hay Elementary students and staff give us back to the community. We also have an archery program that will be launched in the, uh, right after Christmas. Uh, our gymnasium teacher, Mr. Nagy, received a grant and believe it or not, students will learn the techniques of archery. We love our communications uh, with our parents. One way of communicating is through Facebook. However, being old school, I love making phone calls to parents, and that is a requirement of the teachers to make phone calls to the parents to report the good things, not necessarily things that don't always be so good. Hay Elementary School is a Title I school. What Title I does is provide additional support to students that are in need. Title I, we have two main big events that we put on every year. Just last night, we had our annual Title I reading night where Mr. Harris was the guest reader and read How the Grinch Stole Christmas. It was done virtually and we had a few students to attend and we had a good time doing it. In the spring, we will focus on mathematics. At this point, I would like to now turn it over to our technology, our digital integration specialist, Ms. Melanie Meyer. Hi there, my name is Melanie Meyer and I am the Digital Integration Specialist at Hay Elementary. I have the wonderful job of working with teachers, students, and parents with technology. So whether your child is a virtual student or an in-person learning, they are provided with a Chromebook at Hay. Teachers at Hay are using Google, Clas Google Classroom, Classroom as their teaching platform. 
Students are exposed to digital citizenship and many interactive programs, such as RAS for kids for English and I IXL for math and SuccessMaker for our bilingual students. Teachers at Hay are also finding many creative ways to access their, um, these programs through um, things like quizzes, cahoots, and many different ways to assess uh, the students' learning. So we know that technology is constantly changing and we continue to learn new things so we can give your students the best experience with technology. So please check us out on Facebook to see all the great things that are happening at Hay. So now I would like to turn it over to our social worker, Courtney Smith. Thank you. Hi, as Melanie stated, I'm Courtney Smith. I'm the school social worker at Hay, and I'm gonna tell you a little bit of things that we do at Hay to support our students. So every student will have the opportunity to learn more about social emotional learning, which teaches skills like self-awareness, self-management, social awareness, relationship skills, and responsible decision-making. Not only through the school social worker, but the teachers do it as well. As a school social worker, I help run groups that incorporate SEO skills and competencies every Tuesday and Thursday, um, specifically with fourth and fifth grade. I also assist our fax staff with home visits to families regarding school absences. Also, I have a virtual office that is not only for students, but for staff as well, that has information about community resources regarding clothing assistance, food assistance, utility and bill information, referral sources, and mental health support. I also have a Google Classroom that serves as a safe place for e-learning students to contact me to do check-ins, talk, or let me know how their day is going. And it's just helpful information about SEO. Now, back to our principal, Mr. Harris. Thank you, Mrs. Myers and Ms. Smith. Very, very good. At Hay Elementary School, there are a couple of other things I would like to make mention, make notice of. We do have bilingual support for our ELL students. In addition to that, we have a great special ed program, or special education program, I should say, uh, where the kids do receive great services, in my opinion. However, I would like to say, Hay Elementary School is not just the special school in South Bend. Every elementary school in South Bend, every middle school in South Bend, and high school in South Bend are very special. You cannot go wrong with selecting a school in South Bend. Thank you very much. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out, 393-2200, or follow us on Facebook. Thank you.